33 other breaking news we are following right now. A large police presence outside a gas station this morning in Shelby County. WRHG's Kwame Chua Wilborn is live right now outside that location on Hacks Cross. In Q, you have learned brand new information in just the last few minutes. Absolutely. So we heard back from the Shelby County Sheriff's Office and they are saying that this is a death investigation and they are focusing that investigation right here on this car wash here on that first washing bay. That's where we're told around 420 this morning, a deputy was in the area and noticed the vehicle sitting there in the in that washing bay. We're told by the public information officer for the sheriff's officer for the sheriff's office that that deputy uh, did a welfare check and that's where they discovered two deceased adults inside of a vehicle at this car wash. Uh, we were able to get a look at that vehicle. It appeared to be a black Nissan Altima. Uh, we we're told that again, both of these individuals were pronounced deceased on the scene. Now we have asked exactly, you know, if deputies have determined exactly how these individuals died or how long they had been sitting here. But of course, that is all under investigation. Now, Dorita, like you mentioned earlier, they also have this gas station that's right in front of the car wash blocked off as well. We're assuming that they're probably checking out any surveillance video or trying to talk to any witnesses in the area who may have seen anything, heard anything. Again, the cause of death is still under investigation and exactly how long they had been sitting here is under investigation as well. So again, this happened around 420 when that deputy came across those two individuals inside of that car. Uh, it appears they may be out here for several hours. So we're going to stay out here as well, working to learn more information about these two victims and just working to learn more about what exactly took place here. That's the big question this morning. So stay with WREG as we gather those updates. Reporting live from Southeast Shelby County, which will WRG News Channel 3. Oh, Kumitra, a lot of new information coming in in just minutes. A busy scene, and by the way, a busy area. We're going to keep you updated. Thank you. Well, this is